at Sports Focus is presented by Dr. Ting Sports Medicine and Orthopedic Surgery. Joined now by Peter Kalamai, outside linebacker for Stanford Cardinal. Peter, media day, it's always the beginning of the, of the season coming up. How you feeling? I'm feeling great. You know, the guys have been working hard all summer, and this is our last week of summer conditioning currently. And um, I like the progress I've seen from our young players, and I'm um, really just excited to see what the season brings. Fourth year senior, how big of a transition has it been since you know your freshman year? And you told me out off camera, you know, you're originally from NC. You know, that transition coming over to the Bay Area, you know, four years. That's a that's a big time for for some personal growth. Yeah, you know, um, the good thing about being from so far away is Coach Shaw does a great job of nationally recruiting. So, you know, you're not alone. There's guys from Georgia, there's guys from North Carolina, there's guys from the East Coast that are going through the same thing you're going through. So that definitely helped a lot with the transition. As for my growth as a player and as a person, um, I just, I love the school. I feel like I've grown leaps and bounds from where I was as a person. As a football player, you know, I've gotten a lot more physical. I've gotten a lot stronger, um, gotten a lot faster. So. You know, the, Shannon Turley is a great strength and conditioning coach, and he's been working with me very closely the whole entire time I've been here. And I really just like the progress I've made as a person since I've been at Stanford. Was there any consideration about staying more local when you were getting recruited? Uh, I like schools like uh, Virginia, North Carolina, Vanderbilt, you know, other great academic institutions. Um, and then I also liked Oregon, which is out here. So that's pretty, and Clemson as well. So those are kind of the five schools that it came down to. But at the end, I couldn't give up this opportunity. A great mix of football and academics. Which you really can't parallel anywhere else. Obviously, Stanford, the last couple of years, been known for you know high-profile players like Kevin Hogue and Christian McCaffrey. But a consistent factor has been that strong defense. How do you foresee the defense playing out in this possibly your final year? Um, we're trying to get back to where we were, you know, a couple years ago. Last year. We weren't, we weren't bad, but we weren't as good as we'd like to be. And uh, we have a high standard set by guys like Chase Thomas, Trent Murphy, Shane Scove, things like that. So we're, we're pretty much just working to get back there. And um, I really like the young group we have. We have a lot of guys that can roll through. We're deep in pretty much all positions. So everybody everybody knows the standard. Coach Anderson set the standard. And we're working towards it every single day. And do you feel any added pressure or you know added uh, uh, responsibilities now that guys like Blake Martinez are off in the NFL? Oh, definitely. You know, I'm a senior now, and uh, you know, guys like Solomon Thomas are juniors now. So we're really the old veterans on the defense now. Dallas Lloyd as well, half power. So we're we're really we understand now that you know sometimes we might have to get on guys to practice. We have to be the example for the, all the young guys. So that's definitely been a change in terms in terms of going from watching the old guys and trying to emulate them, and now we're the old guys and guys are trying to emulate us. Finally, prediction. Any any predictions for the season? Uh, <laughs> um, just a lot more speed from Stanford than you've ever seen before. A lot of speed on both sides of the ball. All right. Keep an eye on there. You might miss it. You got a lot of speed coming at you. <laughs> <laughs>